There is a new supercomputer that is about to be switched on that is called Deep South. I think it's called Deep South because this supercomputer is, uh, is located in Australia. It is a computer that is capable of 228. I mean, this is, these are numbers that are just not really uh, comprehensible, but I'm going to give it to them anyway because this is the reality. 228 trillion synaptic operations per second. 228 trillion, 228,000 billion synaptic operations per second in one second. Um, and they estimate that this is on par with the operation of the human brain. Indeed, this supercomputer, supercomputer was designed to mimic the synapses of the human brain, uh, and it will be running AI software. Um, and uh, it, 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 the idea here is, can, uh, can we mimic the operation of a human brain in, uh, in a computer? It uh, will be, everybody's a little worried, right? They're gonna turn this on in um, uh, next year, and uh, there are those out there who believe that is the end of the world, right? Because the computers will take over from there. Uh, I, I don't, I'm not one of those who believe that, but, uh, but uh, here you have, it's called Deep South. You can look it up, those of you technically inclined, you can find out more technical information about it. I, I don't have it, uh, but this is an Australian project. Um, I love the name. Uh, it, 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 so, uh, uh, yeah, keep track of it and see once it switches on, does the world end or not? I guess we won't know. We'll be on the other side of the world ending.